great feature in Color Director is the ability to add a blur effect to footage. Applied globally, that is to everything you see on the screen, it can add a delicate, ethereal quality to footage. Perhaps of more interest to many Color Director editors, it can also be applied regionally only to specific areas of a scene to bring focus to a subject in a video or even to create easy and impressive tilt shift video effects. This tutorial will show you a couple of examples of how you can use the regional blur effect to improve your videos. First, let's take some footage of a skateboarder. The raw footage already does a pretty good job of showcasing the subject, but by applying a blur effect, we can do an even better job of drawing attention to the skater and giving the video a pro look. After importing your clip and dragging it to the timeline, click on the Adjustment tab, then select Regional Adjustment Tools. We'll be using a motion tracking mask to keep the skater in focus and blur the surrounding area. Click on the motion tracking mask, select an appropriate brush size to outline your subject, then outline the shape. Next, click the Start Motion Tracking button. If at any stage the outline deviates from your subject, you can click the button again to pause and manually adjust the mask. A keyframe will automatically be created to reflect your change. You can show or hide the keyframes panel by clicking the clock icon. When you've finished tracking your subject, click the Invert Mask button, then the Blur section. You can set the degree of blur you want to apply to the background with the slider. Click Play to preview your new footage. Tilt Shift video makes your scene appear as if it exists in a tiny toy land. The best footage to use for this technique is wide-angle scenes that are shot from a distance, preferably from a height looking down on the subject. This is a popular effect and fortunately, using Color Director's Blur Tool and Gradient Mask, very easy to produce. Click on the Gradient Mask and select a new mask. Place this mask on the top edge of your footage and apply a blur to it as you did for the skateboarder. Now create another gradient mask and apply it to the bottom of the footage. Again, applying a blur. The trick is to leave only a narrow central area of the footage in focus, giving the impression you're watching everything through a magnifying glass. To improve the effect even more, you can click on Global Adjustments, then Detail, and increase the amount of sharpness to give the in-focus section crisper lines. Tilt Shift works well with time-lapse videos or those sped up a little. Play around with the blur tool and see what works best for your footage. 